Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. For today, I am going to do a makeup tutorial video featuring one of my favorite drugstore brand, which is Elf Cosmetics. So, kung gusto niyo guys malaman kung ano yung mga products na ipapakita ko dito sa video na ito, just keep on watching. Excited ako guys na ipakita sa inyo yung mga products na gagamitin ko for this video kasi some of it na try ko na and yung iba dito bago. By the way guys, hindi ito full face makeup kasi ano hindi ko kompleto yung mga products ni Elf Cosmetics. So, ayan, zinom ko na kayo para at least makita nyo na yung aking skin condition. Of course, tapos na ako sa aking skin care. Ang ginamit ko ay itong Laura Mercier Flawless Skin. Ito yung ginamit ko lang moisturizer. Medyo mainit kasi ngayon, guys. And nagbabalat din yung skin ko. So, perfect ito to nourish my skin. For guys, nagawan ko ng review yung Elf Potty Primer, yung nakaka-mattify or yung original nila. Ngayon kasi naglabas pa sila ng ibang variant for the primer and I think meron sila yung mattifying tapos itong glow. So siguro yung mag-work sa akin. So since nagustuhan ko yung ano nila, yung original nila na comparable kay Tatcha, sana magustuhan ko din to and sana ano mag-work siya sa akin. Kasi this one, it retails for $8 and available to sa Elf Cosmetics na website. And also, dito sa States, you can find this sa Walmart and sa Target. So, ito guys, yung itsura ng packaging ni Putty Primer. And again, this is the glow version. And sa likod, ganyan siya, clear lang. And if you're going to open this, yung color niya ay parang pale yellow or light yellow. Before kasi yung original version nito, parang baby pink yung color. Ito naman, light yellow. Just going to apply it first dito sa side ng face ko para makita natin kung ano yung effect niya. Kung nakaka-glow ba talaga siya. And instantly, hindi ko alam kung nakikita nyo. Ito kasi yung side na to, kahit may moisturizer, hindi siya ganun ka-reflective. But this side, medyo reflective siya. This is my first time using this, guys. Di ko na siya matetest, pero I can say na glowing nga talaga siya. And it glides smooth sa skin. Amoy, guys, mismo ng product, may faint scent lang siya. Hindi siya overpowering, pero alam mong may amoy siya. Hindi ko ma-describe, pero medyo mag-chemical yung amoy niya. But again, faint lang yung scent niya. Now, I'm going to proceed sa foundation. I am going to use this Elf Flawless Finish Foundation. And this is in the shade of Vanilla, Light with Golden Undertones. So it says here, this is an oil-free satin finish na foundation. Ito pala guys, medyo thick yung consistency niya. By the way, i-swatch ko sa inyo yung Vanilla and ganyan yung shade niya. Sa camera, mukha siyang maputi. Pero sa personal, halos sakto lang siya sa aking skin tone. Now, I'm going to blend this foundation using my e.l.f. sponge. Ito yung pinaka-favorite ko talagang sponge of all time. Miski beauty blender man yan, yung real techniques man yan. Ito kasi guys, sobrang soft niya. And, ewan ko, seamless talaga yung pag-blend ng foundation ko pagkat yung ginagamit ko. And even concealer. So guys, two pumps yung gagamitin ko. And now, I'm going to dot this all over my face. And then, tsaka natin i-blend. Guys, tapos na ako sa pag-blend ng foundation sa aking skin. And I can say na yung coverage niya, it is more of a medium-high coverage to buildable na full coverage. Depende na lang kung gaano kadami yung product na gagamitin nyo. So, ako ang ginamit ko ay two pumps. And ito na yung na-achieve ko. I am going to proceed sa concealer. Um, before, na-feature ko na dito madalas, way, way back pa sa aking mga beauty videos, yung e.l.f. na camo concealer. But... Uh, since na parati kong ginagamit yun before, ngayon naman ang ipi-feature ko itong si Hydrating Camo Concealer. And I have two shades here. So this one details for $6. But si Elf Concealer, guys, na Hydrating Camo Concealer, this one has less coverage than the Camo Concealer. Si Camo Concealer kasi talagang 
full coverage talaga siya and it mattifies your under eyes. Not unlike ito, hydrating siya and mas less yung coverage niya. So, I have medium beige and I have light beige. Yung isa kasi guys, gagamitin ko siya as a peach corrector. I don't know kung nag-register siya ng maayos dyan sa camera, pero ito kasi sa personal, peachy undertone talaga siya. So I'm gonna swatch this sa inyo para at least makita nyo yung sinasabi ko. So this is medium beige. Diba? Maka-cancel out niya talaga yung dark circles ko. And this is light beige. So this one naman is yellow undertone. So ako kasi guys, mas prefer ko na may pagka-neutral undertone yung gagamitin ko for my under eyes. It's because I do have dark circles. So I'm just gonna use this right here. Makita nyo, hindi pa siya ganun ka full coverage but that's fine. And then, I'm going to apply itong si Light Beige. Kasi kung makita nyo, di ba, medyo iba yung shade nitong parts ng aking face dito sa aking mismong mukha. So, kailangan syempre magpantay sila. So, guys, sa eyes ko pala, meron ako ditong dry patches dyan. Kaya pagpasensyahan nyo na kung may makikita kayo dyan parang dry patches. I'm gonna set my foundation and concealer with this Halo Glow Setting Powder. Ayan. And this is in the shade of light. Yun ang shade niya. Mas kaparehas lang siya ng ijura nitong si primer. Mas malaki lang ng onti ito. So, gito guys, si ijura niya sa loob. May sifter siya, which is good. So, ganyan siya. Kita niyo ba? May onti siyang sheen. Kuha lang ako ng ganyan amount. And tignan natin kung okay ba siyang pang set ng under eyes. Actually, okay naman siya. Di okay naman. Definitely, I can see a little bit of sheen to it. So, hindi siya talagang matte, glowy talaga siya. So, dito din sa kabila. kapag nagpa-powder ako ng aking face, I make sure na pinipress ko talaga siya sa skin ko so that ma-absorb or mag-bind together talaga yung foundation, concealer, and yung powder. For my eyebrows naman, I do have like three products here. And these products, guys, talagang tried and tested ko na sila. So first, na ipapakita ko sa inyo itong Elf Wax. Ayan. This one, kung gusto nyo ma-achieve yung mga um, bushy eyebrows. And I have two kinds of eyebrow pencils here. This one is the brow pencil in the shade of natural brown. And this one is Atemimi Made Me Buy It. Itong isang pencil na ultra precise brow pencil in the shade of natural brown. So, zinom ko kayo guys para makita nyo. I'm gonna use muna itong si brow pencil. Magkukuntur lang ako ng aking face. Ang gagamitin ko ay itong Milani Silky Matte Bronzing Powder. Wala kasi ako guys na gusto hang elf na bronzer. Now, I'm gonna proceed sa eyeshadow. And I'm gonna use this bite-sized eyeshadow. Actually, parang halos parehas lang sila ng kulay, ano? Yung shade range nila, guys. I do have here um, cream of sugar and wala na tong isa. This color right here, I'm gonna use my finger. Grabe talaga tong bite sa eyeshadow nila. get this shade first and I'm just gonna put it sa outer V ng aking eyes. By the way guys, 
hindi ako mahilig talaga maglagay ng eyeshadow and I'm not expert pagdating sa eyes. So, balik lang uli ako dito sa shimmer shades. I'm gonna get this shade and then intensify lang natin ng onte. Pasensya na guys ha, hindi talaga akong magaling sa eyeshadow. Since wala akong eyeliner from e.l.f., I'm gonna use ito na lang si Marc Jacobs na color brown. And ito yung gagamitin ko to line my eyes. So, ayun guys, na-apply ko na yung aking falsies. Nahirapan ako. <laughs> After ko na ayos yung uling aking eyelashes, I'm gonna apply a little bit of eyeshadow sa lower lashes ko and I'm gonna use a pencil brush. Ko lang ng onti guys, yung orange shade na part dito. Naging mukhang malaki yung aking eyes. So, ayan guys, tapos na ako sa aking eyes. Later, i-retouch ko na lang siya with a mascara. For the blush, wala din ako guys na um, blush from them. Na declutter ko na yung iba. But I'm gonna use this Love Me More for you too in the shade of I Kiss You. This is M7 I Kiss You. Sobrang ganda nito guys tong for you too na Love Me More blushes. Long lasting siya and also ano very pigmented. And I'm gonna put a little bit here. Ayan. Diffuse natin ng onte. Magaplay na ako guys ng highlighter and this is the Elf Metallic Flare Highlighter in the shade of White Gold. And I'm curious ako sa kanya kasi parang blinding ito. So, gamit tayo ng brush. This is from Beauty Sensations. Again, from Michelle V. Basics. And parang ang dry ng formula niya. Tingnan natin, guys. Parang ang dry nga ng formula niya. Mm. Pero tingnan natin. Iba kasi yung swatch dyan tsaka sa mukha. Mmm! Dry lang yung formula niya guys, but pag once applied na siya sa face, kumakapit naman. Kung mahilig masyado sa highlighter, it's because I have textured skin. On to the last part, which is yung lips. Meron ako ditong ano, lip product. This is in the shade of Nectar, and this is a lipstick and bagay siya sa ating look for the day. At gamitin ko tong all-time favorite ko na lip contour from Huda Beauty and this is in the shade of YV. Guys, tatapusin ko lang yung aking makeup and ayusin ko lang yung aking hair. Then, I'll be right back. Ito na guys, yung ating final look for this makeup tutorial video and I'm very happy sa na-achieve kong makeup look. Alam niyo naman ako, bibihira lang ako gumawa ng ano, ganitong klaseng makeup look, yung may kung anik-anik dyan sa aking mata. Doon lang ako usually guys sa simple tsaka sa basic na makeup tutorial video and I'm very happy na at least kahit pa paano na i-share ko sa inyo yung mga ganitong klaseng makeup tutorial video. Sa totoo lang guys, hindi talaga ako confident when it comes sa uh, 
paglalagay ng eyeshadow kasi matagal na akong hindi nakakapag-practice and also hindi ako makeup artist. Mga ginamit kong products guys, to be honest, lahat sila nagustuhan ko. Yung e.l.f. talaga kasi one of my favorite drugstore brands yan. And sobrang affordable nila and yung quality talaga nila maganda. Sana na-enjoy nyo tong video na to and sana nagustuhan nyo tong video na to. If you do like this video, of course, you can click the thumbs up button and if you want to get notified with my future uploads in this channel, you can click the subscribe or the bell button down below. So thank you so much for watching guys and I will see you on my next videos. Bye!